Resurfacing concrete. Although concrete is one of the most durable building materials available, time, traffic, and the elements can cause the concrete surface to spall, wear, and discolor. Quickrete Concrete Resurfacer can provide a new, durable, wear-resistant surface on old, worn concrete driveways, sidewalks, and patios that will last the life of your concrete. Quickrete Concrete Resurfacer will renew your concrete surface at a fraction of the cost to tear out and replace old concrete slabs. As with any concrete repair project, proper surface preparation is essential for a successful result. This is especially true for Concrete Resurfacer. Old concrete must be rigorously cleaned to ensure proper adhesion of the new surface. A high strength 3500 PSI pressure washer must be used to remove any dirt, oil, grease, or deteriorating concrete prior to the application of concrete resurfacer. Concrete resurfacer is ideal for resurfacing large areas like driveways, patios, and pool decks, but because it sets quickly, it is important to section off your work areas to no larger than 144 square feet. This will allow enough time for placing and finishing the resurfacer before it begins to set. It's essential that control joints and expansion joints are maintained to allow for slab movement. These joints can usually be used to define your work area. Weather stripping can be used to prevent concrete resurfacer from spilling into the joints. Before resurfacing your slab, deeply spalled areas and large cracks should be repaired using concrete resurfacer that has been mixed to a trialable consistency. The repair should be allowed to harden before resurfacing the entire area. To mix concrete resurfacer, a five gallon bucket and a one half inch drill and paddle mixer should be used. Hand mixing in standard concrete barrel type mixers cannot be used for this application. When mixing or placing concrete resurfacer as with any cement mix, it is important to wear safety glasses and waterproof gloves. Measure and add three and a half quarts of clean, cool water to the five gallon bucket to mix one 40 pound bag of concrete resurfacer. Then begin to add the powder to the water while mixing. Mix for about five minutes until a lump free, pourable consistency is achieved. If the mix is too thick, add water sparingly to reach the consistency of syrup. If the mix is too thin, additional powder can be added. One 40-pound bag of concrete resurfacer covers about 90 square feet, one-eighth of an inch thick. So a typical 16-foot by 24-foot driveway will use about five bags of resurfacer. Because the application process is continuous, it is always best to have a few extra bags to allow for any changes in thickness or waste. Prior to applying concrete resurfacer, saturate the surface with water and then remove any standing water. Concrete acts like a rigid sponge. Dampening the concrete will cool the slab and prevent the mixing water from being drawn out of the material during the resurfacer application. You are now ready to begin the application process. Pour the resurfacer onto the concrete in one foot wide strips. Then, using a long handled squeegee, scrub the material into the concrete surface. Working back and forth, evenly spread the resurfacer onto the slab. After about five minutes, a non-slip finish can be applied using a concrete broom. Make long strokes across the full distance of the work area without stopping. All broom strokes should be made in the same direction for uniformity of appearance. A concrete edging tool can also be used within about 20 minutes of pouring the resurfacer. Concrete resurfacer has a working time of about 30 minutes at 73 degrees. In hotter weather, the working time will be reduced. Using cold mixing water and keeping the bags of concrete resurfacer shaded will help extend the application time. Under normal conditions, no special curing is required. Although in temperatures over 90 degrees, moist cure with a fine water mist for 24 to 48 hours. Because concrete resurfacer is polymer modified, temperatures should remain above 50 degrees for at least eight hours and should be protected from freezing for 24 hours after application. Concrete resurfacer will support foot traffic in about six hours and vehicle traffic in 24 hours.